Welcome back to Let's Play with Gray. I'm Gray. Let's play Disney Extreme Skate. And when we last left off, I had three collectibles to achieve that I still haven't found yet. And don't worry, I did go through a practice run of this game and collect every single collectible and beat every single mission. So I know it can be done, but it is frequently kind of difficult. Especially in levels like this, which is why I really don't like levels like this. By the way, this is a, like a mini waterfall. You can't go into it, but it's what you come out of every time you go into a different waterfall. Alright, I got an Ollie stat point. So I'll be a little bit better at jumping now. Hooray! Alright. Did a thing. Alright, so now. I think I just need to search the ground. I don't think I've gone around enough, like, yeah, there's one right here. Uh, I don't think I've gone around enough on ground level to find all of the metals, so I just need to do that. There's one. And by the way, with some characters, not with the, the kid character, but with some characters, this level has the hardest metal to obtain, or collectible to obtain, in the game. And it's right at the end of this branch, and it's just because there's no good way to get to it. Uh, I meant to do that. And I, I can't, I still have a hard time remembering what ways I use to get to it, and it's just a really, really difficult to get collectible. But you'll see that when we get to it. All right. There's one more collectible that I haven't gotten yet. Go this way! Oh, it, I was totally right. And I unlocked a new trick, which is Gray's special air. Look out below. And I'm gonna try and show you how to do that really quick. I'm not great at the tricks in this game, to be honest. Um, yeah. I'm not great because... But you don't really need it too much for this game. But I did it. I totally beefed it. Let's see if I can do it without um, falling. Man. I think you may have to build up your special meter in order to do special tricks, but I'm not really sure. I've never truly understood the special meter in this game. It doesn't really seem to apply to a lot of stuff. I know that it depletes after you fall. Yay, I got it. That was worth nearly 5,000 in just one trick, no multipliers. So that's pretty good. Alright, so now... Oh, I don't want to exit that way because we're doing story mode. And story mode means that we go to the thing like we're a real person. And I wish there were a better way to do story mode when you have to use the characters, but there's not. Don't worry, we will be using, uh, like, all the Lion King and Toy Story and Tarzan characters at one point in this Let's Play. Um, and I'll try and give you a good idea of everything you need to know about that character when I do that. Because there are some required missions for those characters, and there's collectibles in every level. Let's talk to Captain Salt. <laughs> ah, this thick sea air and constant fish eating has left me with a terrible thirst. Would you be a real first mate and bring me five bottles of the finest clam cola you can find from inside this here grocery store? I don't know why I totally started doing a manual when I started doing that. Okay. So there's clam soda, which sounds disgusting, but that is the joke. Um, we need to collect five of them for Captain Salty because he's a salty man. Okay. Um, and then there's one up here. And there's also some metals in here. Um, I haven't decided yet. I might be utilizing those black bars at the side of the video to keep a tally of stuff uh, in each level because I know that with the video quality I have, it is sometimes difficult to read how many metals I have and stuff. Hopefully the video quality is a little better than when I tried earlier, but I don't know if it will be. 
I'm just gonna get that. I don't know why I'm collecting these metals while I need to be collecting these sodas. And I'm trying really hard not to burp right into the microphone. I think there's just one down one of these aisles. Yep. I am forever in your debt, matey. I is forever in my debt, matey. Alright, many ears. Many ears. Okay, while we're in here, let's do this challenge. Oh my gosh. Stuck. Our store is having a contest, that's right. See if you can grind and crash 1,000 bucks worth of groceries before time runs out. If you do, you will win a fabulous prize. I'll win a fabulous prize. Alright. So that is the goal of this. It doesn't make any sense, but that's fine with me. Because I like to smash. Smash, smash. You, you can also grind here. And you have lots of points when you break those big pumpkins. Uh, you just get a few points when you grind along. Alright. Get all of those. I keep missing a couple, but that's all right. Lunchables there or something? Not really Lunchables because Lunchables isn't a sponsor of this game. But you will see who is a sponsor of this game. All right. Now this level, this or mission rather, this mission can be kind of difficult if you don't know that you actually have to try. It. Like. You think, oh, I'll just ride around, smash some stuff. You might not finish the mission. You might not get it. All right, here, let's do it. Uh, because one of the best ways to get all of the stuff in the game is to, uh, other than what I just showed you, is to get up on top of there. Is to go really quickly, jump, 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 and grind along the tops of those shelving units. Look at this mess. Just kidding. You did great, kid. I'd say you won. And I got a Yucatan hat. I don't know what that means. All right, here we go. All right, and I exited the grocery in this area. What a. Oh yeah, I was gonna show you the sponsorship in this game that I find a little bit hilarious. And it is right over here. Oh, I don't want to go in the lighthouse. Stop it. Stop it. And where are we? We are at McDonald's. Hi. Thanks for coming to McDonald's. Want to do me a big favor? Some of our favorite customers are too busy today to get lunch. Make timely deliveries and you'll be greatly rewarded. The first delivery is a double cheeseburger for Hamish. Take it to him and then come right back. Now you'll see, they just said what Hamish's name is. Oh, I'm stupid. He's up there. But when you talk to Thanks him... Thanks for the double cheeseburger. I was starving. Thanks for the double cheeseburger. But when you talk to him later, they don't give him the name Hamish. They call him Tough Kid. Thanks for delivering the double cheeseburger. The next item is a medium order of fries for shopkeeper McDougal. Don't let them get cold. That's a really good fries animation with the squareness and the... And then not looking like French fries. These fries are exactly what I wanted. These Thank fries. You so much. Are exactly what I wanted. Thank you so much. Alright, so we're gonna do some spins. Great job with the fries. Now Leslie is really thirsty, so please take her this carton of milk. Pronto! Which is kind of disgusting that she's gonna which by the way here's Leslie hey Leslie do you want this do you want this milk Leslie 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 do you want this do you want this milk oh wait no they're not talking about that version of you they're talking about the version of you that's way over here in the movie theater so that's a dumb thing that exists and she's over here she's a hippie thanks dude I was totally thirsty or a hipster whichever and she wants to drink milk on a hot day, which is super disgusting. Oh, okay, we're almost coming up on our third video limit. I bet Leslie really appreciated her milk. The last delivery is a rush order for Captain Salty for a baked apple pie. 
Alright. Catman Salty wants an apple pie. I'm surprised he didn't want a fish filet. Like, I guess they wanted to advertise a few specific things. Ah, that baked apple pie be perfect, says I. Thank ye kindly. Nice job. You did great. Please take these very special shoes is our way of saying Now, that thanks. is the only item in the game where it will show it to you when you earn it. And no, I don't want to save. But I might go back and equip those later, or I'll at least show you them. I'll create another character later just to show you all the stuff we unlock. Now, um, let's see, what else do I want to do while I'm here? I guess, let's, uh, let's do the skate mission in this level really quick. This is the fastest way to get around town, is to grind those edges. Oh, I totally missed. Collect the letters skate in any order you like. Just make sure they're all there. Okay, friend? Okay, friend. Okay, so we're gonna go this way. Oh! Yes, man. It threw us for a loop. It put us facing the wrong way, but I knew to grind because I practiced this level okay. 50 million nice. times. Well, I would look like I'm really good at this game, even though I'm not. Alright. Oh, there's a T, it's over here. And then the E. Um, if we don't get it, we have plenty of time to go try again. But if we aim ourselves right, this shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, I got that E. I got that E. For sure. Alright. I unlocked the Norway shirt, and I don't know what that means. Alright, and we are... Uh, I can do, like, one other thing. Let's see. What other thing do we want to do? I bet there's a mission in the skate park somewhere. Yep, and we're going to talk to Hamish, who is not going to be called Hamish. Get that high score. Get it! Get it! He is the best character ever made. Who did? Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Now, I used to use grinds. Here, I'll use grinds as an example of how to grind for playing. Especially in, if you find places like these that have, uh, like, these are gaps. But I would go tell it anyone you broke my score if I were you, uh. Oh, and we unlocked Skater Lil' Romeo, so that's fun. Uh, no, I don't want to save it. Um, I totally forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah, but I used to always grind when I needed points. Like, whether I was playing multiplayer or I was just um, trying to get points um, in one of those missions, I would always... Um, oh my gosh, I'm bad at commentary. I would always grind, but I learned that lip tricks are a little bit easier and a little bit less time consuming. And a little, just, easier not to fall off. So, in our next one, I don't feel like going to the Tarzan level. So I'm going to go over here, because I know what's over here. It's one of my favorite levels in the game. I fell on the ground. It's Andy's room, so... Next time, we're going to work to Andy's room, and we are going to play the video game. Uh, I'm Gray. Thanks for watching. I haven't figured out how to end the videos yet.